Harvey. And I'm Vanessa. I'm Travis. And we are late to the party, and we are in our animation domination. Ooh, week ooh, ooh, two. Copyright, copyright infringement. Is that a real thing? Yeah, I don't know, but welcome to <laughs> Better Late Than episode Never. Of Better Late Than Never. <laughs> we are down the animation rabbit hole, but no Disney allowed. No Disney allowed. So, Travis, we've seen Dawn Bluth's An American Tale in the first oh, trailer tear reaction. Tearjerker for that one. And I'm sure. Since it's not Disney, you're probably going to touch on a little bit more of Mr. Bluth himself. Not, not that Bluth. Not, 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 yeah, no. no. He's not there is no banana stand in uh, this one. You can always tell him if Milford Man. Well, <laughs> what do we have for trailer yeah. number two? Well, it's an animation film. Oh, yeah. well, in that case. 1992. All right. So fresh in our youth. Well, especially Vanessa. What is it? <laughs> Let's see. You just I had a burp that was like stuck there, but you know. <laughs> it's raining like magic. Oh, is it Gargoyle Island or it is a magical island. world of oh, yeah. wondrous creatures playing the day away? Red light. Red light again. And we're an unusual Robin girl Williams. named Krista, dreamt of faraway places. Where are you going? Until the day Krista ignored the warnings of her friends. Basically, Krista, Krista stop. Stop. And flew where no one had flown before. There, she made a huge discovery. Look out! You prank me? Uh huh. Catch on quick, doesn't it? Are you really a human? I'm Zach. I'm Krista. Yeah. This weird creature is a human. Don't you think you're a little old to believe in human tails? Humans don't have tails. They have big, big bottoms that they wear with bad shorts. Now, <laughs> Zack is rocking and rolling well, with a red tie. If I'm gonna eat some pie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Blasting off with the Beetle Boys. Oh, oh, oh. Ten on a falling leaf. And swinging around with a bat who's totally batty. Oh, oh I'm blind! Oh, no! I can, I can see! see. I can. Miracle! <laughs> but with the same joke from Robin Hood. Yeah. Yeah. You see Zach anywhere? No. We probably cut out early. Who accidentally released an evil force named Hexus. There goes the neighborhood. Now, to get back to his world, Zach now, must help trailer. Krista find the everything. courage. We've got right. nowhere else to go. And the Spoilers. magical power to save her world. I think I tell you there's magical All powers. All right, forces. coming. We're going to war. <laughs> 20th Century Fox invites you to witness the wonder, the music, and the adventure of a place worlds away. From anything you've ever seen, Fern Gully, the featuring new songs forward. from Elton John, Sheena Easton, Tone Loke, Raffi, and many more. A music by Alan Silvestri. All right, all right. So good cast: Robin cast. Williams, yeah. Tim Curry, Christian Slater. Oh, uh, I got that question right, Ashmore. Tone Loke. And that's, <laughs> that is one of the movies that I remember was incredibly popular when it came out, uh, especially because a lot of like the. The EPA and everybody was coming out. Save the rainforest. It was very much a uh, message type film. Of course, absolutely. And the message was well received because I remember growing up and it was reduce, reuse, recycle, and close the loop. Uh, and it was all about save the rainforest. And mm -hmm. this one was a fun movie that put Robin Williams, you know, on a kid level. And you're like, my God, this guy is fantastic when it comes to VO to the point where. The genie was his... Like, we're soon after yeah, this. So, on. I was going to say, because this came out in 92, right? Right, right. Aladdin came out in 92 as well, I believe. Well, this was June. I think Aladdin was, like, August or September. But I'm saying to I the fact remember. that uh, it, it, genie overshadowed This is, a, again, true. Yeah, absolutely. You don't hear, when you think of voiceovers for Robert Williams, the first one you're going to think of is the genie. Not, right. You don't remember, bat, not... you don't kind of, you're like, oh, yeah, I, that's right. He was the bat. But, uh... Although, although, Bat That Stands Out f for me a little bit more, Bartok from Anastasia with uh, Hank Azaria. That's very true. I remember that he does remind me a little bit more of that uh, as well. But I prefer like Bartok. Bat. I will say this, though. Um, during that time, Aladdin was kind of the one that I gravitated towards mo most. Right. 
I did watch Ferngoli, but I didn't watch it in theaters. I watched it after it came out on VHS. Yeah, Ferngoli was not one that I constantly watched. And in fact, when Avatar came out and everybody after I had seen it was like, oh, it's Ferngoli. I was like, oh yeah, it was Ferngoli because Ferngoli wasn't really at the back of my head. Even to the point here, I'm like, there were songs. Yeah. I remember Alan Silvestri's score but I don't remember there being singing going on in Fern Goalie because it, 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 well, I did not watch it. It's based on a book, too. Did it's, not know that either. Yeah, it's. I, um, that either. I don't remember who wrote it, but it is a book. I know that. Okay, like a children's book. That's cool runnings. But <laughs> Fern Goalie, Fern Goalie, uh, I, I, it, it's, it's. So of course we've all seen it. Just it's right. not one that's yeah. in the forefront of our mind. Right. Would you see it based on this trailer? Uh, yes, because it does give you more of what's going on in this story and you kind of feel like these people are coming together and then there's this <laughs> big bad guy and you're just like, you want to know what happens to them. Well, I mean, it was more For so me, anyways, when I was a kid, jerk yeah. humans destroying the rainforest. That's true, too. Yeah, that was one holes. of the things that's like, God damn it, these people destroying the, the home. And I, I, I remember the iconic, like, <laughs> Like where they, she goes to shake her hand and she puts her hand back up. Like I remember that so iconically back then, uh, up until now. But would I watch it? Uh, it? I did watch it after I saw that trailer. I didn't go to the theaters either. Um, but I, I would watch it because it's it's it, it basically laid it all okay. out to so you, for me. You would watch it then. I mean, today being who we are today, right? Would we walk over to the TV and put it on and watch it? No. No. <laughs> Sorry, no. it's not one of those non-Disney ones that I like gravitate all the time to. I'm yeah. like, I have to watch this. It didn't make me cry. I, yeah, I mean, like, <laughs> like one of the ones, the non-Disney ones that I absolutely love is Anastasia. So. Yeah, have you heard? There's a Princess in St. Petersburg. I, I did Based animation. Based true events for that yeah. one. Yeah, it was Fox. Very bad. Yeah. Um, so. What have you guys seen? Have you seen this movie? Do you like it? Is there something that we're not missing that you just love so much about it? Let us know Tell in the comments us below. Let us know why, why you love this movie so much because that's the good thing about movies is that something you might not like, somebody else absolutely loves, and that's that's why they make these movies, mm -hmm. and that's why movies are being made. Absolutely, so, and it did well enough that they made sequels, so somebody loved true. it. There I mean, it's not a horrible movie to it wasn't there, yeah. yeah. So what did you guys think? Let us know again in the comments below. You can like and subscribe. And do the thing on our Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, Startups. All the social networking gin joints, you know where they are. Kicking the party, feel the party, keep the party going at our Patreon. Gets us where we need to go. Thank you so much, Travis for bringing us a second episode in our Better Late Than Never animation series. So thank you guys so much, and as always, now it's time, time to say, say goodbye. goodbye. Bye. Bye. We should do animation voices. Huh?